The federal government is considering setting 18 years as the minimum entry age for admission into tertiary institutions. This was disclosed by the Minister of Education, Professor Tahir Maman, during his inspection of the ongoing Unified Tertiary Matriculation Examination, UTME, in Abuja. Professor Maman underscored the significance of allowing students reach a certain level of maturity before embarking on higher educational pursuits. Our correspondent has more details. The 6334 system of education introduced in 1983 established 18 years as the benchmark for admission into universities and other tertiary institutions. The Minister of Education, Professor Tahir Manman, during the recent UTME monitoring exercise in Buari, Kansu area, expressed concern that some candidates are too young to comprehend the demands of university education. He pledged that the Ministry of Education would investigate cases of underage students being pressured into university by their parents. In response to the proposed 18-year criterion for higher education, Nigerians have taken to social media to voice their opinions. While some argue that frequent strikes in government universities result in prolonged years of study, others point out challenges related to age limits, especially considering employers' age requirements. However, there are those who advocate for early graduation to enable students to enter the workforce sooner. On the other hand, some users have applauded the government's directive, emphasizing the importance of acquiring relevant experience before pursuing tertiary education. The discourse surrounding the entry age for tertiary institutions reflects the complexity of educational policies and their implications for students' academic journeys and future career prospects. Naomi Ulewibi, ADBN News.